Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to install macOS the whole public beta one on virtual machine. So the last video I make is uh, Mac how to install macOS uh, the whole beta three on virtual machine, but I didn't uh, make the video that has show you how to install macOS the whole beta four. So I think I will make the video of how to make macOS the whole public. Oh no, I mean the whole beta four. Now let's begin. Now go to your browser. First of all, you need uh, macOS the whole public beta one. Uh, ISO. So you just type take recharge macOS Tahoe. So it will show the uh, website. Uh, visit this website here. Alright. So I'll put the link in the description. So make sure to check it. So you can see here. Just release the public better one. So I'm gonna click on go go drive or modify. It's up to you. But I've already have the macOS Tahoe public better one. So I need to download it. Now the next thing is you need VMware Station. Uh, so you're gonna visit this website. Now you're gonna click on VMware Station Pro for PC. Alright, so you will need to sign in the boardcom to uh, download the file. So we're gonna use the other way to download. Now we're gonna go to VMware Station Pro 17.6.4. Now you're gonna just click on download as normal, but I've already have uh, VMware Workstation on PC, so I need to download it. Also, I put the link in the description. You guys make sure to check it. Now the next thing is you need to have the local tool file. So this tool is patching for macOS, so you need to have it. Now right click and choose extract. And now the default VMware workstation don't doesn't doesn't have the uh, Mac OS yet. So you just you just uh, run the local file as administrator and. You would need to remember the VMware workstation location. If you keep the default location, that you just click on patch as normal. Or if you move it to another location, you will need to find it again. Now, you're gonna click on patch. So you can see here, I've already patched it. Uh, now it's don't allow me to patch again. Now we're done. Uh, when you are already patch it like in the video now you're gonna run VMware Workstation Pro
Now you're gonna click on create a new virtual machine. Now you're gonna choose the macOS Tahoe public better one. Here. Click on next. Now you're gonna choose Apple macOS and choose the version as macOS 15. Now if you want to keep the default location, you can keep or you can change it to another location like me. Now select your numbers of your processor cores and the numbers of the per core processor. And now you will need at least eight gigabytes for you need at least eight gigabytes of memory for virtual machine and at least um 80, 80 gigabytes for macOS, the uh, public better one. Now you're gonna click on finish. Now before we run the virtual machine, go to your file explorer and choose the macOS Tahoe public better one directory that you've created. So my macOS Tahoe public better one is in this location. Now go into it and find the uh, file called VMX. But if this um uh like the end don't appear like this <coughs> in window, you're gonna click on th three dot and choose option. Now you're gonna choose view. Now you're gonna take on the box called show hidden folder and drives and click on and untick the box called hide extension for known file types now you're gonna click on apply now you can see here it's well will pops up the file called macOS 15 dot vmx now you just right click on it and choose edit in notepad scroll down until you uh, scroll down till you reach the end and you're gonna press shift enter and now you're gonna type smc dot version zero now you're gonna click on file and save <coughs> now you're gonna close the window and click on power on this virtual machine And now when the screen <coughs> pops up, you're gonna um, choose the languages. So uh, if you already if you already watch my video, uh, you will see of my horrible computer specs. But that but we'll talk it later. So you can see here the mouse is very struggling. Now choose languages and click on English. Now you're gonna choose this utility. Choose the VMware Virtual and VME disk. So you can see here it's not the utili utilized. It. Now you're gonna choose arrays. And remember, format into APFS and the Chimin GUID partition map. And if you wa want to rename it again, you can rename or you can keep. So I will name it macOS. Tahoe public better one. Now you're gonna click on erase. Now you're gonna click on done. Close this window. Now you're gonna choose the macOS Tahoe better. Click on it. Click on continue. 
Now I'm gonna click on continue. Agree. And now you're gonna choose the disk that you want to install my course, so here's my disk. And now you just wait for it to complete the installation. Alright, so when the screen pops up, that means you're good to go, but um, I will say it to you again, I don't have a uh, computer that good enough. My computer just run an i3 9th generation, and you see here, it's pretty struggling to run Mac OS Tahoe, public better one, and virtual machine. So, that is, so if your computer is strong enough, you can continue or if your computer is uh, doesn't good as same me so that is a sad sign so that is how you install my course tahoe public better one on being web station so if you like this video then please subscribe to my channel don't forget to click on the like so share this button and watch my new video and now goodbye